This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment and educational purposes only. And anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube album stuff so you get the videos I put them out. See what I'm thinking, see man, a lot of that data. But like I tell every day, the day they release us is false. And many give us a false narrative of the market so we can make bad trading decisions. Listen, Bing, Bill Wang or Kegel's criminal trial had closing arguments yesterday. And the prosecutors are claiming that the reason Orkegos collapsed and Credit Suisse collapsed and companies lost over $160 billion in share price was because Bill Wang lied to the banks about his derivatives, about his uh, positions in certain stocks. And that is not what I believe came out in trial. I was paying attention to the case and in my opinion, and this is just my opinion, I believe that there was overwhelming evidence that the banks were fully aware of what Mr. Wang and Arkegos was doing and they were in bed with them. There was so much evidence showing that Bill Wang was sharing his positions with the bank and the banks was even encouraging his investment decisions because they made more money. Okay. The banks were encouraging his very questionable investment decisions. And now, even though the evidence was revealed in court that the banks were fully aware of what Arkegos and Bill Wang were doing, the prosecution wants to only hold Bill Wang accountable. Do you think that all these big banks who were in bed with Arkegos, who were fully aware of the derivatives and all these questionable investment decisions that he made, questionable positions that he had, will the Southern District of the DOJ bring any of these guys to justice? Will any of them be indicted for what happened to Arkegos? What happened to Credit Suisse? What happened to other banks? And not just the banks, retail investors who saw hundreds of billions of dollars in share value drop overnight because of Bill Wang, Credit Suisse, and other bad actors. I don't think so. They got Bill Wang or Kegels at the scapegoat. And the only reason, the only reason that they went after him is because some of the one percenters lost money. If the only people that lost money was retail investors, pension funds, and institutions that follow the rules, Bill Wang would never have been arrested. Just like FTX, Sam Bankman Free had the only people that lost money was pension funds, retail investors, and institutions that follow the rules, Sam Bankman-Fried would still be out here robbing and stealing. But that is a system of law enforcement that we have in the United States right now. You are not allowed to rob from the 1%. If you do, if your actions cause the 1% to lose money, even if the 1%ers were in on it, you will be held accountable. Maybe we'll get some overzealous prosecutor who will go after the bad actors who were revealed in the trial to be complicit with Arkegos and Bill Wang and all these questionable trading activities that cost retail investors hundreds of billions of dollars. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think the DOJ is going to go after Bill Wang's accomplices who were big banks who were in on a derivative scam. Anyway, have a great day. God bless and I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.